Hello, 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 hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking on to my video. This video will be for all my beautiful and my handsome Aries out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a generating, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. So please say the product that does and what doesn't. Leave it on out. Also, this could be the past, the present, or the future. And to be aware of any scams in the comment section pretending to be me. Lordy, Aries, Aries, Aries. Wow, Aries. Um, you moved away from something. Your spirit guides, your spirit, your heart, your soul was telling you to, you know, go out and explore something or go in a different direction is what I'm getting with the Six of Swords. So you had to move away from something. Okay, something that you felt like kind of was like a hindrance to you. But at the end of the day, it's like some of you, you felt like there was a different calling or a different purpose and you needed to focus on that. For some of y'all... It's like you just started up your business, you became an entrepreneur or some type of just boss here, okay? And you're protecting that and you're closing out any old cycles or what have you that no longer serves you, okay? But here's the thing. With the Son of Cups here, there is a King of Cups, a uh, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, don't have to be, or it could be a King of Coins, okay? Towards Virgo Capricorn that is definitely looking at you this person could have been a charmer could have been a smooth talker could have had the gift of gab okay or something of that nature you know are used to get in their way with you know for what they say they just told you things that you wanted to hear whoever this person was here aries and um it's like this person wished they would have you know let their guard down is what i'm getting whoever this king of cups is they wish that they would have left their guard down for you because they realized that that was more of a burden to the relationship than anything else this person now is sitting in self-pity boo it's like they're crying they're crying over spilled milk baby they need some milk okay they're crying right now whoever this person is they're crying it's like they they also want to be left alone so this person cannot be making appearances around people that they know maybe family members whoever they just want to be to themselves right now um for some guys this could be a virgo could be a cancer but this person definitely wants to, you know, stay to themselves at this time. They don't want to move forward. They could even be going through car issues or something of that nature where they're stuck right now. All right. But this person could have even had an episode where they picked up some glass or, you know, like a glass cup or glass plate and just threw their beach just to let their anger and their frustrations out. I'm telling y'all, this person here beating themselves up. Like in a harsh way. They are judging themselves in the worst type of way. Like this person is what you call taking accountability. But taking over to the extreme. To the top. Okay. Y'all hear that? But yeah. Due to whatever they did. It's like they're, they they just. They're drowning in the self pity, pity y'all. Like they are judging themselves very harshly for what they did to you. Or whatever whatever happened between the two y'all. Because you was their sense of peace. You were this sense of understanding. You were their guide is how they're, they, they're viewing it. They're realizing, okay, you are the missing piece to the puzzle, all right, is what I'm getting. It's how they feel about you here, Aries, boo. All right, so they're they're definitely in regret. Okay, we got the sun card, Leo energy. So this person is definitely in regret, wishing that they never went, away, went about things that certain way. You feel what I'm saying? They wish they would have had a different approach because whatever they did, it kind of got you like, mm -mm, caused y'all to split up a little bit or whatever it may be. But with the Sister Cups, this person is definitely reminiscing about the both of y'all still like right now as I speak. Okay, this person is also thinking about their childhood, of what happened in their childhood to cause them to, you know, react and act a certain way. Okay, is what I'm getting. Mmm. Yeah, this person is realizing something here. So with the Eight of Wands, it's like somebody here with the Eight of Wands to the Queen, uh, yeah, the Queen of Wands. It's like this person definitely wants to, you know, reach out to you. They see how confident you are. They see how you know you just stand your ground. All right, you're very passionate and fiery. But at the same time, it's like you have already learned your lessons in life. Okay, maybe you try to tell them something. Maybe you recognize something about the ass. Okay, maybe you gave the asses the truth about something. You just put them, you know what I'm saying? You know, let them get, put them on game about some shit. But at the end of the day, it's like you do you. Okay, is the energy that I'm getting. But they're going to be some type of communication. The person wants to reach out to you. But right now, what they're doing is they're, ooh, love. I don't know, their money could be a little bit funny. 
okay but they're trying to heal right now with the star card aquarius energy but until that's when they're going to approach you once they feel like they have done enough healing and also their money situation is better than you know say what it is right now is what i'm getting so what we'll see well we got the tower so something could have just happened out of the blue okay maybe this person might express themselves to you out of the blue with the queen of cups okay or they feel like you're going to cuss them out this person is afraid too because here goes the offer right here with the nine of cups um i just realized that but it's like this person is afraid of you rejecting them telling them no you don't want to deal with them anymore just get the fuck out of my face they're so scared of this outcome okay yes it's a cup but they can't stop reminiscing about you okay moving forward to how you know what however this person left your life or however you left their life it's like they keep replaying that shit in their mind <laughs> they keep replaying that shit in their mind yeah queen of coins yeah this person knows that you oh wow we got the king and the queen of coins so this person knows that you went off to you know just worry about your finances and shit you feel me three of staffs but yeah so there's there there's distance between y'all but, ooh, honey, you guys might definitely run into each other or something of that nature. But, mmm, you feel like something else is calling you. It's faded. I'm definitely getting it's a project or something that you could be working on. So, you're thinking more logically about the situation is what I'm getting. Like, if it's meant to be, it'll happen. Okay, but at the same time, right now, it's something that you're doing. Something that has your focus here. All right? Yeah. You're worried about your wish fulfillment. You're not in the cuffs. You've been praying for something and you finally got it. Okay? You, so, oh, yeah. So, you're not ready to make a decision just yet when it comes to this person? Yeah, Ace of Stabs. Okay? So, something is, is creative here. Somebody here is definitely going to be apologizing. I'm telling you. They're manifesting you to come back into their life. Aries is what I'm getting. What else? Queen of Cups. I can't make it up. Then we got the devil. Ooh, so for some of y'all, I don't. Mmm. Aries, Aries, Aries. Who's this Queen of Cups? Let me see. Oh, we got the Queen of Cups and the King of Cups. Hair fine. Oh, somebody's in love with you. Taurus energy, Capricorn energy, Aries. Somebody in love with your ass, boo. Like they. <laughs> The full card, like somebody wants to take a risk, but this devil card is good. Let's see, what's, what's the devil? What's the devil? I knew it. I knew it. Be careful. Okay, be careful, Aries, because we the devil clarified by the magician. What does that tell you? That's magic. That's fucking magic. Somebody's doing magic. Is somebody here in the background is jealous? Could be in someone's family. Like somebody literally in somebody's family. Like somebody doing magic to juggle some shit between the two of y'all. That's fucked up. And this person over here going through it. Trying to figure out what they really. They know. they Like they blaming themselves very harshly off this shit. But really the, behind the shit is some fucking magic. Are you fucking kidding me? You sour puss ass bitches. Like really? Trying to make this person juggle and shit. Like What? But you're about to get balanced, boo. Justice energy, Libra energy, period, point blank. All right. So you about to get your goddamn justice from this bullshit. Shit is about to balance out. Okay. Don't even worry about it, boo. Yeah. These people here that group together or whatever to do this bullshit is going to turn right around on their dumb asses. Yeah. Vesting in this shit. Why they try to make this shit hard? Harder than what it was. Yeah, eight of swords. Somebody wanted somebody to betray somebody, make them feel like the victim. Well, congratulations, bitch. Okay, but what's meant to be is going to come because whoever this man is, he's beating himself up. Okay, what? So what should you? So what should Aries do? We got the Queen of Swords. This could be a bitter bitch, a bitter bitch from somebody's past. This is a bitter bitch from somebody's past. Five of Cups. This. Uh, this isn't somebody's family for sure, for sure. Or somebody they have a family with or something is what I'm getting here, Aries. Two of, two of Cups, a relationship that you have. Somebody's so fucking jealous of a relationship that you have about it becoming a success, about you guys getting recognition, okay, and all the attention. So somebody here has been lying, okay? Seven of Swords, sneaking and planning, okay? Uh, strength card, Leo energy, 
Okay, nine of swords. This person is now worried about the truth coming out, though. About you receiving some type of new beginning. Because regardless, you're going to shine, baby. You're going to get what you deserve. And that's just what it is. Temperance. Because some of you, ooh, you a motherfucking earth angel. See, this person is obsessed with you. They can't stop watching you and seeing what you got going on. This is what I'm getting. This is a fucking lying ass pig. Yeah, trying to see if you're stuck or not. But really, you're not. You're going to give to this person regardless. This person is going to give to you. Pure point blank. What's the outcome? What's the outcome? Ooh, so I see a reconciliation. Somebody else is going to be left out in the cold, baby. Pure point blank and stuff, period. Anyway, I'm going to end it right there. Okay, Aries? Because that kind of pissed me off a little bit. Motherfuckers doing magic and shit. Like, I'm trying to figure out, like, what's really the problem? You know what I'm saying? I, don't, I ain't see this person doing you dirty or nothing. And it's all because somebody did some type of magic to make you think that somebody was doing something or that's some bullshit, okay? People need to mind their fucking business and stop fucking hating. Raggedy motherfuckers. Ooh. Anyway, they getting theirs though, okay, Aries? <laughs> Don't even worry about it, boo. <laughs> What's meant to be will be, okay? Yeah, like I said, there will be communication with the Eight of Wands. And I'm going to end it right here. I'm going to end it right now. I love you guys. See you guys next time. Bye.